So, I'm finally back home and in my outfit of the day. I couldn't do a video this morning. Hello fashion sewers, I hope you are well. If you're new to my channel, I'm Colleen G. Lee. My channel's all about inspiring, motivating and sharing ideas for upcycling fashion. So if you are into that sort of thing, it definitely is worthwhile subscribing to my channel. Not only that, I'm also on the Patreon platform. There's a link in the description. Make sure you click on it, read the different levels of the membership and please do join one. So let's get into the video. Today's outfit is a refashioned top, a pleated skirt that's just whirling around. I just love the way it feels and moves. Um, so it's a refashioned project. I was, I was in two minds whether or not I really like this because I did try to reverse it to see I like the back of it more than I like the front of it. And then when I was putting it on, this got tucked inside, like so. And that was like, oh, I like that. And then, so it's, it's not quite there. But I think if I put a press stud right there, that is cute. So that is what I'm going to do. Because I was originally just going to have one lapel up and one down. But like I said, that got tucked in when I was putting it on. And so I do like that. And then I was kind of like hmm, playing around with it, like so. And it's like if I put the crest up there, I just like what's happening here, these angles. So that is what I'm going to do. I think I've been enjoying it a lot more now. You know, yeah, it's just, yeah, absolutely. That's that's just the finishing touch. Pressed up there. So next time I wear it, it won't be opening up like this. So you have a better look. I stood right there. I'm wearing it with um, a pole in it. It's been gorgeous. Yeah, definitely there. So it's going to pop open for now. That's fine. That's what happens when you are refashioning um, garments that somewhere along the journey as you are wearing it, you know, things happen. And I like to let garments do what it wants to do sometimes um, because we tend to wear garments the way we feel it should be worn. And sometimes when things like this happen where it tucks itself in for whatever reason, I love that about clothing. It's almost as though it has its own mind and that's what I like. So yeah, that will definitely be happening because that is so cute. Anyway, so like I said, this is a refashion project and I'll put a link to that in the description. I'm wearing it with a clutch. So a sparkly clutch adding a bit of glamour to the time silver jewellery, earrings and a bracelet. Yes, I was tempted. Actually, I could do one. Yeah, I could do that, but no, I won't. <laughs> I'm talking about my tassel earrings. Um, so let me show you the back again. And that's it, that's my app today. Wearing it with some shoes. I've actually had these many years. These were back in the 90s, I do believe. Square toe ones, which are quite fashionable now, and they're, they're like, yeah, I have, I've had quite a few shoes like this over the years. Um, yes, so that is my outfit for today. Hello, I'm finally back home and in my outfit of the day. I couldn't do a video this morning because it was so dark and the lighting in here is not that great but it is a lot better than it was this morning. So I'm going to do things in reverse, <laughs> as you can see I'm already dressed. So I'm just going to take off each one of the layers and explain my outfit for today. And it is freezing out, oh gold. Um, I'm kind of in a monotone look of browns. So let me start with my gloves. So I've added a pop of colour. So for people, this is a tip, for people who don't like wearing colour, but do want to introduce colour to their wardrobe, then one way to do that is 
with accessories. So as you can see, I popped on my gloves, which are like a, a raspberry colour, raspberry pink colour. And I think, I'll take my glasses off. I'm just posing with these actually. <laughs> um, yeah, so I wore some sunglasses. And like I said, um, my gloves needed them today. And that's just to add a pop of colour to what I'm wearing. I'm, actually, I'm flustered now, I'm really hot. <laughs> and I've got a crossover bag. Take that off. And a really warm, not, not, it's not showing, but it's kind of a version of one. Oh, this is so warm. It saved me today. A three quarter length coat with a fur collar. I'll take that off. It's quite heavy as well. Back to one side. Oh, oh that's all so snuggly. Anyway, so I'm wearing, I've got layers on as well underneath. It's got three layers on. Three layers, yeah. So I've got cotton, which is camisole underneath. And then I've got a polo neck, which is wool. And I've got this jumper, which is wool and also mohair. So yeah, I, I was definitely prepared for today. I was definitely prepared for the weather. Um, so I haven't made anything today, I haven't made pants, but I do like these pants, these, if you would have seen these before. So they're quite high waisted, so I'm doing the half tuck situation, um, sailor pants, and they come all the way down to the floor and have some brown ankle boots on. So that's my outfit for today, oh yeah, my hat, yes, <laughs> my woolly hat, I haven't worn this in a while, with this uh, furry bu bobble on top. Yeah, so let's see, jewelry wise, I've only got gold earrings on, and that's it. Let me just give you a quick twirl, twirl and show you the bottom half of me, and then I will relax for the rest of the day. I'm wearing a pop of colour today. This is a refashion project. It looks really orange in the camera, but it's a bit more dull. It's not as bright. Um, like I said, I have a video tutorial for this refashion project and I'll link that below. It has cute pockets. I just love the asymmetry of this. It's gorgeous. I had to make it short sleeve, but that will be explained in the video when you watch it. So I'm going to be teaming this with a leather jacket, a collarless jacket, because I want this to be the focal point to the way I look today. So it's a blues on style leather jacket. Right, got that kind of action going on I think. Let me zip it up first because I want some of the cardigan to be shown. So oh, that's sticking out like that. Oh yes. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. And then I have the lower part like that. So I've got some orange peeping below the jacket and the collar. And this is me. Yeah, that's nice. Just zip up a little bit more. the back. It has its inseam pockets. Yes it does. It has inseam pockets like my trousers do. My pants. These are from the CGL collection so yes I did make these. They are um, they are above the ankle so I'm wearing ankle boots. They're my ankle boots that I've got those. I don't know what you call this. The back. This kind of like marble effect brown marble effects to the heel and I will be wearing it with this bag 
cost the shoulder bag. Pull that zip down a little bit. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, that's that's looking good. And then some gloves. not wearing any earrings today. I decided not to because I want to wear my own. <laughs> I'm going to shut up about these tassel earrings of mine. Yeah, that's what I want to wear. So I might put them on at some point. I don't know yet. <laughs> but no, I don't, I'm not wearing any earrings today. So I've got some leather black gloves. And yeah, and that's my look for today. Oh, no, I think what I will do is this is my accessory for my face instead of earrings. What do you, what do you think? <laughs> That's my outfit for today. I'm in leather again, but this time it's leather pants. Um, they are a dark blue, so I'm in a monochrome look, and you know I love my monochromes. I do. I'll admit to that. A lot of people don't like it. I don't know why. Well, you do know why, but yeah, I love my monochrome look. So I'm in navy blue from top to toe, including my shoes, and I just love this jacket. It's a refashioned jacket. These leaves are amazing. Yes, you will find a link to this tutorial. You will find a link to the tutorial for this in the description. It's just gorgeous. And I love it. Show you the back. I am going to be teaming it with items that I have designed and made. Future accessories for a change. So this is a refashion project. And I'm wearing a navy blue polo neck. One of my few polo necks that actually do come to my wrist bone. <gasps> so I'm treasuring it. Seriously, I've had it in enough years, a lot of years. So I'll show you how I'm going to accessorize it. So yeah, it's blue, it's navy blue. <laughs> and a bit of black in there as well. Same with the jacket as well. The jacket has. Um, it's predominantly navy blue, but there's specks of black in there as well. So I'll be wearing it with my scarf just to keep me warm. And I'm going to be wearing these gloves that I wore yesterday. Um, I do have gloves that do go with this scarf that has the fur trim, but I don't want to wear it. It's just, it's just a little bit over the top, and I just want the sleeves to be focus point as you can see that the these gloves don't draw that much attention which is excellent so it's all on the sleeves still same staying warm and then finally it's going to be my clutch my look for today. Well, I hope you've enjoyed my outfits of the week. If you have, then please do like, give it a thumbs up, do share and do comment below. Let me know which one was your favourite outfit and which one was your favourite project as well, your refashion project. And I will see you in my next video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and do click the link for the Patreon platform because that's where you'll find me. See you till the next video.